What's going on my fellow residents, it's me the Frozen Cavern and today we're going to continue through our journey of Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep Aqua Story. In the last episode, we went through the Enchanted Dominion and in this episode, we're going to start off with the Radiant Garden. Now, I'm not sure if I'm going to have this as all one episode because with Vincent's story, that's uh, what ended up ha I don't know, that's what ended up happening and it ended up being like 40 minutes long and I don't want that. <laughs> so, I need to make sure to actually stop this time whenever I feel like I need to stop, so. Whenever I get the chance to, I'll just do my best to actually cut it off. Unless this world ends up being shorter than I think it would. Excuse me. I'm terribly sorry to bother you, sir. Oh, oh, what a well-mannered lass you are. Oh, I'd be pleased as punch to help you, if I can. I'm looking for a boy who's not from around here. Have you seen him? Hmm. Not exactly know, that descriptive, but... He scampered off toward yon castle in a right Why is the apostrophe gone there? Thank you so much. Oh. Or am I just reading that really poorly? I think I was. And now we we got miscommunication because if you know from the other episodes or the other playthroughs, then why is that aiming downward? Yeah, my controller's messed up. Hold on. <laughs> All right, I had to switch controllers because for whatever reason, my uh, other one decided to just look completely downward. I don't know why, but uh, we actually can't go that way, so we have to take like the longest route around. Which would be this way, I think? I might be wrong, but uh, first actually, there's a bunch of chests around here. Or really just two. I'll get this one, and since we're going back over there anyways, I think. Uh, I don't know if this is the right way, so we're gonna... It, it hasn't told me wrong yet, so maybe it is the right way. Okay, yes, this is the right way. By the way, we are back to being somewhat weak. <laughs> yeah, that unfortunately happens a couple of times in this game. Except for really Terra, because when it comes to his strength, it's uh, it's the best one out of... Ow. No, I'm gonna... Okay. <laughs> Let's make a priority here. Get those guys over there. They are the ones I need to get. Get you out of the ground before I do anything. And three. Okay. Much, much more properly handled. No, give me my prizes. Oh wait, he can't take both prizes? Come on, I actually never knew that. Alright. Uh, it's not going to catch that stupid flying one. Like I've said before, that flying ow, that flying unverse is one of my least favorite in the game to actually deal with. There are so many unversed around. Let me put y'all to sleep. Uh, I'll get not you. I need to deal with you because you're low on health. But yeah, this is gonna be very frustrating to actually try and deal with. And unfortunately, this doesn't exactly do much damage. This uh, finisher. And unfortunately, it also doesn't do well when it comes to aiming. Uh, there's so many here. <laughs> I'm gonna spend a lot of time in this one area and it sucks. Alright, get in the wind, uh, Typhoon. What's in their prices that. I guess the stupid Unverse picked them up. Ow. Okay, I need to actually heal. There we go. Ow. I would love it if I were to stop getting hit by those. But yeah, this is just gonna be a lot of just fighting. Ow. There we go. Get over here, you.
Oh, that's actually perfect. It's not gonna kill them both, unfortunately. Get over here. Dang it. Actually, I have Fission Faraga. I can use that. Especially since you stopped. Alright, now they deal with the rest of you guys. Alright, hopefully I ignite the right one, and I did not. Unless it died, I don't know. I want to hope that it did. Well, I haven't seen it swoop down, so... Uh, another poison edge. There we go. Get over here, you. And I'll just wait for the fire to kill you. There we go. And yeah, the reason why we're not out of a... Uh, well, somewhat not out of battle is because there were unversed up there. And I'm not going to be able to use this thing on them in time. So I'm just not going to worry about them. But there is a chest over here that I can get, so... Strike Raid, that can be somewhat useful, I guess. Yeah, commands take forever to actually level up. Oh, I could have used a Spell Weaver on these two. Alright, and you're not dead. Just wait for that to kill you. There we go. Alright, get over here, you two. By the way, just because their poison thing is there after you hit them doesn't mean it's actually, you know, stuck there. Uh, you guys are flying now. That's nice. Uh, no you don't. You are not getting me with that. Or you are. Okay. There we go. And Firestorm will absolutely obliterate you. No, get over here. Okay, that can just burn you. There we go. Uh, it's nice finding a way to actually take down those guys. And like I said before, Fission Fire Raga is extremely powerful. So, it is a wonderful addition to have. Especially since I, <laughs> since I cheated earlier on to actually get it, but whatever. By the way, there isn't really any speed running tactic to actually... Well, there... Somewhat is, but uh, it's really weird to do. And besides, I would need level one in order to do it anyways. And as you can tell by now, uh, level one's kind of impossible. <laughs> so no. Okay, there's a lot of them over there. Perfect. Want to always try and get as many of them in one swarm as I can. Unfortunately, that one is all the way over there. I don't know how that hit, but whatever. Okay, there we go. And unfortunately, that's it for those, but uh, hold on a second. Okay, Blizzard Edge is finished. Do I have anything else I can use that's already made for me? No, I don't. Um, what can I do with these? Nothing. That's fun. Okay. Uh... I don't think it really matters. I want to level them both up anyways. Um... Let's switch this out with... We'll be more useful for the next fight. Maybe Confuse. I don't know. Just, just something else. Besides, I'm not really going to use, uh, Confused, like, religiously, so... Using in this upcoming fight ahead will actually benefit me a lot. And then there's this little chest here. Penancia, don't... Need to remember to, uh, sell that later. There's no way I can fight like this. 
Hurry! You gotta get that girl to some place that's safe. Who are you? Why do you have a keyblade? I'll tell you later. Right now. I like to ask where he came from because he kind of just jumped up out of nowhere. And now we are about to work alongside Mickey Mouse, our boy. Can this game please load? There we go. Yeah, you guys hear me complain about that a lot. Hopefully 1.5 and 2.5 won't have that issue because I do plan on getting that. So, hopefully, it. I'm just really hoping it doesn't. Uh, have the issues that 1.5 and 2.5 had. Uh, there we go. How are you not dead? Oh no, get out of the ground. <laughs> Ow, one of you are still on the ground somehow. Get over here, you. Why are there so many? That's like six. Okay, that confusion didn't work. Get you because you are a very, very unfortunate person to actually. There we go. And we just. And I think we. Uh, of course. Let's just burn you. There we go. Nice and quick. Thank you. My name is Aqua. I train under Master Ericus. And I'm Mickey. I used to be Yen Sid's apprentice. I came back to him for some more training. I sense light within this girl. You think that's why they attacked her? Yep. I think you might be absolutely right. If you ask me, she must be somebody pretty extraordinary. Hmm, I wonder if the next game is gonna say otherwise. I'm quite certain she's someone we're supposed to protect. Let's join forces. Oh no, not now. I'll be okay. See you real soon. Here. Are these for me? I picked you some flowers. Thank you for saving me. Oh, they're lovely. You're so sweet. My name's Kyrie. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm Aqua. Kyrie, about that late. Kyrie! Oh. oh, Grandma! Wait, Kyrie, just a minute? I never realized that Kyrie's shoes are actually like slippers <laughs> until now. I just cast a magic spell on you. One day when you're in trouble, the light within you will lead you to the light of another. Someone to keep you safe. Thanks! <laughs> there you are. <laughs> it's time to go. Okay. Oh. <sighs> Grandma? Hmm? What is it? Could you tell me that story? <laughs> Again, dear? Please. <laughs> Very well, then. <laughs> Long ago, people lived in peace, bathed in the warmth of light. Everyone loved the light. Then, people began to fight over it. They wanted to keep it for themselves. And darkness was born in their hearts. The darkness spread, swallowing the light in many people's hearts. It covered everything, and the world disappeared. But 
small fragments of light survived in the hearts of children. With these fragments of light, children rebuilt the lost world. It's the world we live in now. But the true light sleeps deep within the darkness. That's why the worlds are still scattered, divided from each other. But someday, a door to the innermost darkness will open, and the true light will return. So listen, child. Even in the deepest darkness, there will always be a light to guide you. Believe in the light, and the darkness will never defeat you. Your heart will shine with its power and push the darkness away. Mm-hmm. Okay, I know that's a good story and all, but I really doubt I that story took them from like really near to the stairs accident. just to get over to start going down the stairs because that was a long story and I don't think there was that much area to actually walk. On first, it never ends. And now we have a Mickey D-Link and a better Keyblade that we... Uh, we are very grateful for getting this Keyblade. Now, um... I'm actually going to end it here, and this is actually a lot earlier than it should be. However, the main reason why is because I don't want the episode to linger on for way, way longer than it should. So, I'm just going to have this end here. So, until the next video, take care.